At the current moment, we are loading the smoke stang up to go to the track. It's a monumental moment. This is an experimental moment because we don't know what we're gonna break, but we've got bungee cords, so. It's gonna be like that off the track. So, woo, woo -hoo! A little faster though. If we bring tools and stuff to fix it, that's just a sign that it's gonna break. If we don't bring any of that stuff, it's not gonna break. You gotta have faith. Faith, you doubt me? I will break every drive line in this county. So I am really worried because the little V6 rear end and axles might be in danger. That's how you know it's a good Raptors if it's squatted. Dude, it's yeah, really squatted. It's fine. Oh, it is squatted. You wasn't joking. That's a natural bump stop, is that what that is? You know, if you don't look at the trailer, somebody from South Carolina paid $150,000 for this. You put the green handle in because it's more fuel efficient. And also, it's better for the environment. It's going green. Just don't get out of control. I am a race car driver. I am a semi-professional race car driver. Did you know that? I'm gonna dub that to say I like big dicks. No, it's I'm I'm a semi-professional race car driver. I'm a semi-driver. I've got a CDL, so I can do this. So how do we get up to the front? Do I have to walk all the way up there? I belong. I know what. You know. I have no idea, but I'm just gonna act like I do. I smell burritos. Is this right? Yes. This smells great. Huh? Oh, it's diesel. It's a diesel. So I know. Fine. We're good. <laughs> you know. Yeah. I know. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. That, yeah. Than I'm being, that. I am being real inconspicuous here, guys. I actually follow you. You follow me? Yeah. Thank God. <laughs> How far? Yeah. Was you the one that followed me home the other night? Maybe. Well, was you the one looking through the window? I thought that was Steve from across the street. Probably was. So just pull into the staging lanes and then look it over? Yep. Is it okay if my battery's held down by rack strap? I don't know, you'll have to ask the tech I do guys. have a bungee strap if we need to change it. <laughs> this thing has 16 second potential and I can feel, look, powered by bitch dust. <laughs> this thing is ready to rip. Wait, wait. wait, there's something on the other side. Wait, the other side of the Stay right yes, here. just imagine all them Chevelles. If you're going to ride my ass, at least pull my hair. Oh God. By the way, I've seen your sticker before, and that's badass. I love that sticker. The powered by, by bitch dust, dust or pull my hair? Which one? Powered by bitch dust is my favorite. Peeler open. Let's see what's under the hood. Peeler open? Yeah. Are you ready to see the magnificence? I honestly think it's a pretty good shape. It's ready to play. I'm amazed you got that. <laughs> you and me both. Okay, we already got one problem. What's that? You have to have a catch can. A catch can for what? I don't care. So this is this is your overflow on your radiator. So you have to have a catch can on the drag strip. So in case it overflows, it goes into that. And it can't go anywhere else. I've got one right here. So if you've got uh, a hose that you can hook into that, like a rubber hose, I'll I'll steal a hose from somewhere and I'll just hook it into this bottle or something. Yeah. Um, I wouldn't suggest that bottle, but if you I've I got a got Gatorade some, bottle or something. Yeah, a Gatorade bottle would be better because the plastic's thicker. But if, as long as you can do that and then zip tie it in here, I mean, hell, you can, right here on this wiring harness, you could yeah, zip yeah. tie it to that so it stays connected. So are you running antifreeze? No, it's got solid water in it. We, don't, we can't afford antifreeze, dude. <laughs> don't make fun of us. Oh, you followed it? Every day, thank you, dude. 
Hey, if I get up there and I break it, don't pay no attention. I'll just pause by and look another direction. Hey, uh, how many zip ties you got? A ton. So okay, then we're good. We got to be friends. We need to be friends. That's Weston. Everybody in this whole pit area has duct tape and 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 zip ties. You're Did you okay. catch the guy that broke into your shop? Uh -huh. And I was like, somebody copied his damn car. That's uh, got a Cummins in it. I can hear it from over there. Dude, you've got yours held down a lot better than I do. I'm not going to tell them, but mine's tack welded down. It's That's fine. all it needs. It's fine. I don't it's think. It's, I don't I think it's going it. to. What's this thing run? Uh, seven tens right now, but I wish it'd go a lot faster. You think so? Uh, I hope. Uh, hopefully, it will in a couple weeks. I just went and bought a bunch of parts for it. Uh, well. That's how you know you're getting ready to have fun. Either you're buying parts because you're having fun or you broke something. Yeah, exactly. That's how that works. Yeah. Well, well, good luck today, man. I probably need it. Thanks, dude. All right, see ya. Over so the vacuum line. Wait, wait, where'd you get the hose at? Off uh, the uh, bitch dust mobile. <laughs> and the bitch. I just uh, I know, look at it in person. Hopefully you don't disappoint. No. You stuck a 12 valve in a Mustang. Yeah, yeah. Props, dude. <laughs> Uh, that's a uh, EcoBoost. <laughs> Four cylinder, 2.3 liter. New hybrid. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Got good fuel mods. I love the conditioning to make it fit. That's uh, that's aerodynamics yeah. for better EGTs. Better fly off. Yeah. See, the thing about it is he was really worried about installing the EGT gauge, but I'm like, in 15 seconds, it's not going to overheat. It'll be fine. Yeah, Gail Banks would be proud. Gail Banks would be really proud of that. We couldn't afford his intake. He won 500 bucks for that. That was 62 dollars on Amazon. He probably couldn't have beat a whole one. But heck yeah, man. You got it in here. <laughs> what do you think of our overflow tube? Hey. Mm -hmm. This is gonna be good. We need a clamp. We need a zip tie. We need a zip tie. We need a zip tie. You do? Yeah. Well, let me grab some. That man right there is awesome. He shared his zip ties with us. And we're going to use them as a hose clamp because we didn't have an overflow tube. And now we stole a hose off of her car, stuck it into a Gatorade bottle, and now that's our overflow. All right, guys. We are up to the track. We're getting ready to do this. I don't know if we're going to break it. We're probably going to break it. But we're going to give it as good a shot as we can. Guys, here we fucking go. Here we go! Hell yeah, we're gonna do this. We're here to do it, do it. Oh, fuck it, we got the view. Nice to meet you. Good to meet you, dude. This thing's fing cool, dude. <laughs> It took me a minute because I'm like, oh my god! But I left soft. I didn't, I didn't hook it up all the way. I left on like four pounds of boost. I wanted to do it easy to see if I broke anything. And everything's still running good, so we're doing so great. How you guys doing? We'll, but we didn't break anything. Everything's still in one piece. Car's still running good. Like 200 degrees, we're doing perfect, perfectly. <laughs> And I hit the converter at the wrong time. I just hit it way too early and lugged down the engine, but she's got so much more. She's got so much more left to give. How you doing, guys? And, uh, oh, this thing is gonna be sweet. Oh, I fuck. I've never been drag racing. This is like the most awesome thing ever. But guys, I think I'm hooked. It, please, McFarland, is this how you feel? Because this is awesome. This is cool. Dude, there's no, oh my God. This is history, dude. This is history. But I'm shaking. This is awesome. Eight six. There's so much more left to give. This car has so much more that it'll do. It's just the fact of getting figured out exactly how we want to launch it, how much tire pressure, all the things. This is the first time I've ever been down the drag. Track. <laughs>